I think one of the most difficult parts for an artist is our identity and how we feel about our roots. Stravinsky, like all Russian composers, of course has a special place in my heart because I'm Russian. But with Stravinsky it's a special story because um, he, like me modestly, of course, he's a big world traveler. I left Russia very early and America became second home for me very quickly because I was quite young. And now for the third time I changed the continent and I'm living in France now and I'm feeling Russian uh, in my roots, but then a well-traveled Russian. <laughs> It's a short concerto, but there's so much information for every player, for the conductor, for the soloist, for the interaction. And I am incredibly impressed how the orchestra managed to have the patience and to have the temperament to go through three days of recording with the same inspiration from day one to the end. We decided to put together short pieces by Stravinsky as well as uh, Divertimento because they're, they're very few recordings and they're absolutely fascinating. It's, uh, two of them are his own uh, transcriptions for violin and piano from large orchestral works and I think they're absolutely fabulous and I would love for the audience to discover them. My pianist for this project was Katya Skanavi. We had a terrific time putting together this program. We share ideas and we're, we always happen to be on, on the same page, thankfully. And it's a, it's a very complimentary ensemble. I'm very inspired by Stravinsky and his view and his, um, well, what I hear in his music. And I'm happy about the program of the CD because it shows such diversity by the same composer, which I think is, is quite rare. Mm -hmm. 